George, you forgot something more important than your handkerchief. You forgot to cover your sneeze. And cold germs travel on your sneeze or cough, you know. Why, cold germs can fly farther than Miss May can blow the feather. Cold germs can fly eight feet to another child's nose, hand, or food. People who put fingers into their mouths make it easy for cold germs to come to them. Since childhood, we were all taught the importance of covering our coughs and sneezes. Hello, I'm Sierra Johnson. The Center for Disease Control and Ohio University are asking students to play their role in H1N1 prevention. A good way to prevent the virus is as simple as sneezing and coughing correctly. Did you know that in a single sneeze, tens of thousands of droplets are released into the atmosphere? These droplets could land on surfaces such as desks and doorknobs. If these droplets are caught the incorrect way, such as in your bare hands, they can contaminate every surface that you touch. Consider using a tissue to cover your nose and your mouth. It is best to use paper tissue instead of cloth handkerchiefs. The used handkerchief is a breeding ground for viruses and bacteria and could easily spread germs around your face and hands. If a sneeze or cough should happen and a disposable tissue is not available, the CDC recommends coughing into the crook of your elbow. Still curious? Be sure to visit the H1N1 link on the Ohio University website. And remember, prevention starts with you.